What is going on guys? Welcome back to the channel. If this is your first time here, don't forget to go down below the video and hit that subscribe button and be sure to turn on notifications so you don't miss any of my upcoming videos. Now today we're gonna to be taking a look at the RK3588S chip from Rockchip. This chip is easily the fastest ARM-based single board computer chip that I've been able to test on this channel. And it was officially announced and released to the market in early 2022. Now it is starting to be used more frequently in a bunch of devices and even some single board computers like the Orange Pi 5. Now in this video, I'm gonna be showcasing the performance of the RK3588S on a development board that comes configured with 16 gigs of RAM and 128 gigs of storage. Keep in mind that this SoC is currently available in a wide variety of different RAM and storage configurations, and the performance you see in this video is based off of the 16 gig RAM and 128 gig storage device. Now the RK3588S chip is a cutting edge piece of technology. It's really packed with power. The chip is built with a powerful octa-core Cortex-A76 and A55 split CPU with an integrated four core Mali G610 GPU with a max clock speed of 2.4 gigahertz and 1 gigahertz respectively. Now this means that it has eight cores total with four of them being the Cortex A76 core optimized for performance and then the remaining four cores being the Cortex A55 cores optimized for power efficiency. The RK3588S also stands out as compared to other chips like on the widely used Raspberry Pi 4 because the chipset is approximately three times more powerful. It can even be compared in performance to some of the more advanced chips like the Snapdragon 860. So you can rest assured that this chip should have absolutely no problem running even the latest Android titles. Now I'll be showing off the performance of this chip specifically by running different emulators for consoles like Dreamcast, Nintendo 64, GameCube, and even PlayStation 2. But before we get into the actual gameplay footage, let's take a look at some of the benchmark scores for this SoC. As a reference point, the Raspberry Pi 4 single core score is 968 and it has a multi core score of 2476. But the RK3588S, on the other hand, has a single core score of 2950 and a multi core score of 9061. As I mentioned earlier, that's three times more powerful than the Raspberry Pi 4 chip. It's also worth mentioning that this SoC is three times faster than Rock Chip's previous flight flagship chipset, the RK3399, which has been used in a wide variety of devices, including mini ARM-based PCs, some retro handhelds like the Anbernac RG552, and even in home arcade products like the iArcade and the At Games Legends Pinball. Now let's go ahead and get into some gameplay so you can see for yourself just how impressive emulation is on this chipset. That's the right way, huh?
Battle one, fight! <laughs> As you can see, the RK3588S chip is an incredible piece of powerful technology that can handle even a bunch of demanding games and applications with relative ease. And although some of the hacks had to be applied to the emulators in order to get some of the more advanced games for PlayStation 2 to run, overall the device performs really, really well. And I should mention that for this video, all emulation was done through the Android 12 OS. However, there are Linux builds that you can load up if you prefer to go down that road. At the end of the day, I really believe that the RK3580S chip is going to be the future of single board computer gaming, at least as far as it goes for the next year or two. It's powerful, fast, and capable of running a ton of demanding games and applications. Please let me know down in the comments section below what your thoughts are on this chipset, or if you've already purchased the device with this chipset integrated. But that's all I've got. Thank you so very much for watching. And I'll talk to you guys again real soon.